So, stand down. No one calling you special care. Okay. Uh, my name is Don Clark. Um, together we call the song tellers. Okay. We are. I think it's that mic. We are songwriters, Dickie and I. So we only do originals. Um, I'm a professional songwriter. Um, have been for many years. A lot of our songs have got messages in them. Some of them are deep. Some of them are not, but um, we've got a, a, a fairly good selection for you today, and uh, I hope you enjoy it. So we, our next number is uh, written by Dickie. It's called Taking a Ride. Right, this is uh, just so that uh, you guys that splash you here. But basically, this is how we just want you to feel this way, right? Okay, okay. your mind subside Doing the things that we used to do back in 1995 Taking a ride on a roller coaster Don, he can tell you about it. Um, yeah, this uh, this next song's a happy little song um, about nothing really, called "Long Dark Journey."
like the slot machines this little song is for you guys a little song called gambling money for the gamblers Okay, those that know me well will know that I'm vehemently opposed to hunting, particularly trophy hunting. In my opinion, killing for fun, killing only for fun, which is trophy hunting, is exactly the same as being a serial killer. That is, the trophy hunters should be in jail with all of them. Ted Bundy, Dharma, all of them who are dead now. Trophy hunters are no better than serial killers. In my opinion, sorry. Okay, so this song, this song is called Roaring. It's basically an anti-hunting song. Uh, yeah, that's it, called Roaring. Enjoy.
Thank you. So once I had a lot of shit with the, with the chick. Yeah. And so I wrote her a song. I said, uh, until the end of time. Okay, until the end of the time. This afternoon, come on, let's just hear something. Heaven's sake, look at that! All right. Okay, here's another one of my political songs. Uh, well, it's a political song. Went viral some years back. It deals with the pointless uh, pointlessness of different cultures blaming each other, blaming themselves for their problems. But ultimately, it's a song of reconciliation. It's called Blame It On The Whites. <laughs> I 
Thanks very much indeed. Thank you. This next little song is uh, a song I wrote. You know, uh, back in my day, 1970s, uh, you were conscripted to the army. We never had a, a gap, right? We had to go, us guys, eh? Hey? We really had to go, and it had a profound effect on my life because I was in the front lines, yeah. So I wrote a little song about that. It's called A War Within, and I hope you enjoy this because... I think we're still fighting this war within. That's what I think. Reached a certain stage in life where I've learned to war and strife That doesn't mean that much to me I'm a peaceful man, you see And every one of my friends in gold They did not have a choice It's not because I'm writing this That I'd like to raise my voice Taught me how to be mean and hate and how to shoot straight Something deep inside of me Just wanted to be free Every one of my friends in gold Seemed to lose their names It's not because I'm writing this That I feel I am to blame Military madness plays its parts taking over a young man's heart indoctrination has an early start I don't believe we're in we're fighting a war within we'll never win we're fighting a war within Okay, uh, this is a song called The Penis and the Gun. You know, when you consider the levels of violence in Africa, wildlife poaching, serious sexual, sexually transmitted diseases, HIV, the rest, and overpopulation, and the high incidence of rape, surely the two greatest weapons on this continent, the two greatest weapons of destruction, are the penis and the gun, sadly. So, here we go.
We've cut ourselves down to three people just for a little while. Another one or two songs. And um, this is a little song called Six Foot Hole that I wrote some time ago. And it's just about people that tell you lies, like the, you know, the TVs and the, you know, the WhatsApps, all that shit that you read every day. You don't know what the hell to believe, eh? They're right. They don't know what to believe. So, a little song called Six Foot Hole. There's a dust blind on the horizon There's a fire burning low in the sky There's a finger on the trigger He needs to know the reasons why Cause he's a straight shooter with his guns held high No fear, someday he will die A silver bullet for the man who tried A six foot hole and a spirit in the sky Well, it ain't no use pretending And there ain't no time for lies Cause it all comes down to one thing He needs to know the reason why Cause he's a straight shooter with his guns held high no fear, someday he will die A silver bullet for the man who tried A six foot hole and a spirit in the sky Now the TV tells us the story And there ain't no time for tears There's a reflection in the mirror Kinda brings back the years Cause he's a straight shooter Thank you very much. We've got two songs left, so We thought we'd bring back some memories A song that Mr. Don Clark wrote in 1986 was made famous by PJ Powers and he can tell you more. Okay, so yeah, in 1986 this country was burning. Um, I was a young guy and I had a recording studio in Durban and I wasn't very political but one day I sat down and I don't know what happened but I was very moved by the atmosphere in this country and within about an hour or so the song came to me with a Zulu word in it, uh, so it was, I called it San Bonani, and it was, it was one of the first successful reconciliation songs in this country. PJ Powers made it into a hit, but there have been many versions of it. Uh, so please sing along, you all know this one. Thank you very much, cheers. Some may hear the perfect truth, some may be mistaken. You were born in a troubled land, now you feel you must make a stand. But if you just put out your hand, I know it will be taken. San Bonani, San Bonani, why do you cry? San Bonani, San Bonani, we will be together. San Bonani, San Bonani, no need to cry, the sun will shine on the other side. Never again shall it be that this beautiful love will again experience the oppression of one or another. In a book of history, there's a page of misery, doesn't mean there has to be. Final confrontation Happiness and peace will come 
Only when we stand as one Here beneath the southern sun To grow as one big nation Sun Bonani, Sun Bonani Why do you Thank you. We'll be ending off our little set with another song that uh, Don wrote. Let him tell you about it. It's actually quite, quite an accolade as far as I'm concerned. Okay, so in 2008, Splashy Fenn turned 20 and they had a songwriting competition to write a song for the festival. I was fortunate enough to win it with my song, Hey Now Splashy. I think you all know it. If you'll sing along. Just one more thing I want to tell you. You're probably wondering why we're performing up here without a rhythm section, but we have a full rhythm section. Our rhythm section we recorded in the studio, my studio, they, because they're both very shy. Our drummer's name is Digital Dan, and our bass player's name is Bullshit Bertie. But can you give them a big hand, please? Thank you. Hey, nice fleshy. She was standing naked in the river, love and sunlight pouring from her eyes. She smiled at me. I thought I heard an angel say. Welcome, brother, you've arrived With the campfire shining on the water And a glass of old peace in my hand I was closer to the God that I once thought may never be And I was ready for the band Hey, man, and 
Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Folks, can I just ask you to give a big hand to my comrades here? Lee McMillan on percussion and backing vocals. Uh, Tembizo, what do you like being called these days? Special care. And of course, my partner, Dickie Roberts. Thank you very much. Um, we've got a great surprise for you next, so don't go away. Thank you. <laughs>